Did you know that staying hydrated has been scientifically proven to help with weight loss? I'm sharing five tips to help you stay hydrated to help with weight loss and how to tell if you are hydrated. For healthy recipes and science-based and practical weight loss advice from a registered dietitian, me, be sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell to be notified when I post a new video every Thursday. My name is Adrian. I'm a registered dietitian with a master's of science, a certified diabetes educator, and a healthy weight loss coach. I've helped thousands of people with their healthy eating and weight loss goals over the years, and I've been awarded the 2021 Consumer Choice Award for Registered Dietitian and Weight Loss Management. In my last video, I shared why staying hydrated helps with weight loss and the science behind it. You can check out that video here. A brief summary is that our body is made up of mostly water, and water is essential to keep our organs working and can help boost our metabolism and break down fat cells. Firstly, identify if you are hydrated. The easiest way is to see if your mouth and lips are dry, and if your urine is dark yellow or light lemonade color. You want your urine to be pale yellow or clear. Now if you're finding it hard to stay hydrated, I'm sharing five tips to help you stay hydrated to help you reach your weight loss goals. The first is adding ice cubes with crushed fruit to your plain water. Or if plain water isn't your thing, try carbonated water. A favorite of mine is LaCroix peach pear. It reminds me of pear cider without the sugar and without the alcohol. Or try another one of my favorite chilled beverages. Korean barley tea with cucumbers for added refreshment, or crushed berries in carbonated water. There's also bubbly water that's sweetened with stevia, which I enjoy and doesn't leave an aftertaste. However, I know that some people don't like sweeteners, so it's a personal preference. Second tip is carry a water bottle with you or bring an insulated tumbler to keep your beverages cold or warm. No one likes cold tea that's supposed to be hot or warm carbonated water. There are tumblers that keep liquid hot or cold for up to 24 hours. I use this tumbler all the time when I'm working because I like my tea hot. The third tip is set a timer on your phone to remind you to take sips from your tumbler or bottle. I see this as a big problem for my busy professional clients who get consumed with their work and forget to stay hydrated. Make sure to make drinking water a priority throughout the day. The fourth tip is to stay hydrated before and after your physical activity. Be aware that warmer weather and increased physical activities like hiking, biking, jogging, or even walking can cause you to sweat more. And sweating keeps your body cool. But be aware that sometimes hunger can be a mask or thirst, and this can cause you to gravitate towards food when you're actually thirsty. So take a few sips of water first and see how you feel after a few minutes. And the fifth tip is if you're at the park or doing a physical activity, pack fruits and veggies as a snack. Try veggie sticks or hummus or yogurt or fruits like berries, oranges, or watermelon. These are low calorie and high water content snacks. Plus, they are so refreshing when you're out in the sun. You don't have to drink water to hydrate your body for weight loss. Any fluids and many foods, like I mentioned, also provide that hydration. However, water or carbonated water have nothing added to it and is a good zero calorie option. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. For personalized coaching to get you to your healthy eating and weight loss goals, apply for my Elite Weight Loss Coaching Program at adrianrd.com or click on the link in the description below my video. Check out these other videos to get tips and recipes healthy weight loss from me. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up, hit the bell button and subscribe to my YouTube channel.